Soundly is a cloud-based sound effects application, which you can subscribe to the Soundly Pro library. You can also come to store, and even if you don't subscribe, you can still have access to thousands of free sound effects from the freesounds.org library. Just add it into your collection there. There are also a few others here, and you can also buy libraries if you wish and search for other ones. We can also import our own local libraries, and that's very easy to do. So here we have some samples. I'll just drag it over to the interface, release, get rid of this window, and we have some options here. We'll just hit import. It's indexing all those files. And now if I scroll down to the bottom here, right there are all the samples I just imported. Click on them, right there they are. Now let's take a quick look at the interface. So of course we have our play button, but we can right click this and choose auto play. So now if I click on any sample here, it automatically plays for me. I really like to leave that turned on. We also have loop mode. So let me just make a little selection here, hit play, and it loops. Pretty cool stuff. And of course I can come into any of my local libraries, scan through them. I have a search option up here. So maybe I want people. I'll just search and we can tell by this home icon that these are local libraries. We can also see the library they come from here. And here we have our cloud icon. So we know these are coming from the cloud and what library. So if I choose one, it's automatically going to play for me. Let me just turn that off. Let me right click, turn off loop mode and a little more about the interface. Let's go ahead and choose a different sample here. Let's come up here to the cloud. Let's just scroll down a little bit and find something. How about a swoosh? Now this sample is cloud-based and as you saw, it quickly downloaded so I could hear the preview there. And we have this speed or pitch control right there. So I'll just make a selection here. We have this turned down to about 48 and we'll play. Pretty cool. Of course we have our volume control. We can right click and we can do things like invert stereo. We can normalize it there. And we have a waveform control over here. We also have reverse. So let's reverse this and play it. Pretty cool. Let's slow it down even more. Okay, so let's say we like this sample. How do we get it into Pro Tools, for example? Very easy. Just grab it anywhere, move your mouse. You see the interface disappears, and then I can drop it right into Pro Tools. And there we go. There's our sample. And when we play it, you can hear that it's been reversed and pitched down. If we come here to the gear icon or we can go to window and settings, we can see that the audio storage location, you can set that however you want. I have it set to my E drive. So if we take a look in there real quick, you can see right here is that sample we just downloaded from the internet. It was really quick and we can also play it right from here. Pretty cool. And of course it has our pitch and reverse effect applied to that sample. One feature that's really cool is, of course, you probably don't want to search sounds like this if you're working in a large session or something. Maybe we're looking for birds. So we'll search. Okay, but this is in the way of my session. So I can just click the compact view. That puts it down here out of the way. So I can see my interface in Pro Tools. I can go through and check all my samples. These here are local samples. These here are cloud samples. They download very, very quickly. And we can always just grab what we want and pull it right into Pro Tools. or any doll for that matter. Here it is in Bitwig. Here we are in FL Studio. And even Media Composer. Pretty cool stuff. You can even import your existing SoundMiner libraries into Soundly. So that is Soundly. I definitely suggest you go check it out at GetSoundly.com. It's a great way to search for samples, sound effects, search your local libraries and the cloud-based libraries, and you're going to find all the samples you're going to need for whatever your production demands, whether it's just audio, just music, or video as well. It's a really great application. You can get it for free. Go check it out at getsoundly.com.